Previously on Football Manager 22, rebuilding Barcelona. Nice play, nice play. Fat oh, penalty. PK. Round him. Should I create space? Dijon. Hello. Ah, oh, nice volley. Dijon again. Ah, oh, goal. Fun. Three points. Go and cause a surprise. We are for underdogs in this game. Ah, oh. Bruyne. Ah. Just being absolutely battered, aren't we? Okay. I need to change up. It's going to get embarrassing. Um, I need to change up. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, right, at least after changing tactics, we've got a couple of shots. Players haven't woken up and... Oh, good goal. PK. Nice, good play. Oh, yes. The comeback is actually on. Oh, wait a sec. I was just going to make another change. Yes. Yes. Free, free, free nil down. No, no, no. Oh, what a game. Four, three. Daddy scoops September Spanish First Division manager for month. Good day, YouTube. I hope you're all having a great day. Welcome to the third episode of the Football Manager 22 Rebuilding Barcelona series. In this episode, can we continue being top of the league or are injuries going to affect this? We play our must-win Champions League group game against Monaco. And as always, if you wish to watch more videos like this one and further content on Football Manager, Hattrick, FIFA, I would highly recommend to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any future videos. Right, let's jump right in. So, Mallorca is our next stop as you can see from the league table got a game in hand over valencia obviously they must have played on what day it is saturday we're now we're playing on sunday and as you can see if we win this we will stay top so we was top before this game we're at home against mallorca i want to play my main tactic i think if we come across a hard opposition like like for class of man city in a well way i've saved formation i changed at half time and we'll try it out be a fantastic formation, who knows? So four changes. Go. That'd be a nice play. Coutinho turned. Oh, fatty header. Not expecting that. It's good. Okay, so that's not too bad. Team analysis, good touches to shots, ratio and penalty area. Martin Fettling had one back possession more than any other player in his team. But, I mean, we got the goal and look, they actually started to fire up. Happy with that. Impost is completed 93%. Not bad. Possession 64. Tuggles 100%. Headers and 6. In compared to their 51, that's good. Average rating above. So, so far, the correct result. Ooh, great save. Lucky Coutinho. Oh, ah, crap, he's off. He's already on a yellow. It's one of those things. Idiot. Aggression. He's not really an aggressive person. We're winning. Why? Just trying to wonder why he's that type of player to get sent off. Just one of those things, I guess. So, uh, what I might move is for Can, but I'm going to go to my cautious formation and move him out in there. And then pour up. Have a right back on bench. No, could put Garcia there. He's orange. Okay. What we do is we put Garcia on right back, and uh, bring on PK. Come on. Oh, is he going to get sent off? Was it in the box? That's a close one, isn't it? No penalty. Just out. So this is the first time I'm using that formation I used against Man City in the second half. Dijon off. Pay up front. Put Pedri there maybe. Bit of a playmaker. Just because we got a man sent off. Oh, that's a penalty. That's a clear penalty. But he won't send him off though. That's disgusting. Yeah. Not even booked. 
Okay. It's got two penalties from EPK now. Considering man sent off, absolutely buttered him. 18 shots, 64% possession, 93% plus completed. Tick, job done. Move on. Top of the table again. Continue on form. Yeah, Coutinho is surprising me. He is surprising me. Could have a good season. Do I keep him? It's just that wage. It's just a bit like, should I get someone better? I'm beating an eight now. Not scoring many goals, but getting for wins. We haven't played anyone that big yet. Apart from Man City, where we lost 4-3. And Depe injured. Three to four weeks. Bloody Depe injured. Aguero's just coming back. Depe's injured. Oh, God, it's going to be one of those seasons. It's going to go so well. And I'm just going to get these niggling injuries. Or oh, big injury. It's like my Chef Wednesday save. Uh, my main goal scorer, Callum Patterson. He's uh, got a big injury. And now we're struggling to get goals. The board have announced that due to better financial, uh, finances, they have increased percentage of transfer revenue able to retain from player sales to 75%. I don't know what it was before then, but that's good. So you saw our game 2-0 Mallorca at home, and then we played away to Getaf, and we won 1-0. Only just Pedri got the winner, but to be fair, for stats was we dominated. Now we move on to a must-win game in our Champions League group against Monaco. Good thing is we're at home just to try and get those three points. And hopefully Man City beat Atlanta so that we can catch up on Atlanta. So I think Man City's probably just going to go away and win this now. Do I want to go cautious? No. No. We're at home. I want to play my attacking possession football. If it goes badly, then obviously I'll change to what I had against Man City. We lose or draw this, I think our Champions League is over and we go into UEFA Cup. Good start. Just as I was thinking about UEFA Cup. Barcelona and UEFA Cup. Nah, come on, we can do this. This is a group. This is a hard group. Monaco, Atlanta, Man City. Might play cautious. If we're still winning at half time, I might play it go into our cautious. Maybe we should have went cautious straight after one now. Maybe that's something to learn from. He plants in stats. They're getting a bit more possession than us, which is worrying. Yeah, rest of the first half, I just want to try it and actually go to add cautious and see if that helps. Oh, possession just tweaked over. I think possession's very up and down. We're dominating in the middle. But they're holding it in their own. Is that their own half? And just like playing like a really patient game out from and back. Gone. Yes. I don't know how to change anything. We're playing a cautious approach, but still got for goal. Nice. Works quite well against stronger opponents. We was unlucky against Man City. We had started with that formation. 3-1. Yes. I mean, I've got a goal ahead, so I'm quite happy for us to... We maybe go back to our balanced way. Then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take Pedro off and play Aguero in that cam. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. If you would like to watch more videos like this, please subscribe. And to be notified, click on the bell.